Hey guys, it's me Poppy Rain here. Don't mind the messy hair. Coming to you with a new video. So for Easter, Daddy got me one of the dolls I wanted. He got me the Barbie extra doll I wanted. This is number five in the series. There was one other one I was looking at too. But I don't think I'm actually going to get This is the one I really like. Um, and I don't know. I think they're coming out with a series too. Can't remember. But the other Barbie I really, really want is the BMR. One of the BMR dolls. But we're going to open this one. I'm not really a huge Barbie collector. I do have some Barbie type dolls and such. Um... But I do want to start getting into, like, a little bit of the vintage Barbies. But I really want to get into Bratz dolls. Um, I do have a troll Barbie that I showed in a haul video. And I'm trying to think. I have all the Wonder Woman Barbies from the first Wonder Woman movie. I have a Barbie from Jordan. From the country of Jordan that my friend sent me. And I have one of the, um... I don't remember what they're called, but like the Around the World Barbies. The, um, Indian Barbie. And then I have like other Barbie type dolls that aren't actual Barbies. Like I have some, uh, I have three. What is it? Two or three OMG dolls? Three. When I bought two, Daddy got me. I have a one um, Rainbow High. I have like Monster, I have a couple Monster High. I have some, I think I have a couple Ever After High still. I have a bunch. So here's what the back of the box looks like. It comes with 15 pieces. It comes with shoes, socks, a necklace, a bracelet, a puppy, another bracelet, another necklace, another bracelet, sunglasses, a purse, a little car for the puppy. This is super cute. One, I have two Barbies. I greatly regret getting rid of as a kid. Pregnant Midge, the Caucasian version. So I didn't know there was an African American version. But because I didn't know you could just get a new belly plate on eBay. Because my dog that I had growing up ate my belly plate. And then the other doll is a doll that looked like this girl I went to school with. That I'm actually friends with on Facebook. That I traded a friend, my best friend, in kindergarten for. And I regret getting rid of my Mycene dolls and some of my Brat dolls. I didn't have, I think I only had like one or two Mycene dolls. I didn't have a lot of Mycene dolls. I had more Brats than I did Mycene dolls. Do you have any toys that you regret getting rid of as a kid? I do. I, I literally, like, mingled the socks. They're going me. I guess we'll open the puppy first and take off the puppers. So, I don't understand the puppy and the car situation. I don't understand why the puppy comes to the car. I don't understand why she comes to the puppy in the first place. Now, guys, just for the record, I'm not against Barbie. I had, I, that was my main dolls as a kid. I had baby, a few baby dolls that I was obsessed with, and then I had mostly Barbies. I had my Barbies until I was in 11th grade. Or sorry, until I was in 8th grade, 7th grade. So, Okay. First of all, I don't like this puppy. It's pla it's hard plastic. It doesn't really do anything. So he's kind of weird. 
And then I love this little Jeep. This looks like the old school traditional Barbie Jeep, which I actually had one as a kid. Or no, it wasn't a Jeep. It was, one, it was a Barbie car, though. Sorry. My dolls had a Barbie Jeep. I had an actual Barbie car. Which, I mean, I think it's cute, but I don't understand the point of... And the dog only sits sideways. And the dog doesn't really, like, as you can see, doesn't really stay in. There's no way to hold the dog in. So, I don't understand this whole get-up at all. Next thing we have is, of course, every Barbie has to come with a freaking a freaking purse. Why does every Barbie come with a purse? It looks like this purse would open, but in fact, does not open. Okay, that's pretty lame. This purse does not open. And why does this purse have a cell phone on it? Looks like a perfume bottle with a cell phone on it. And, ew, confused. It's like hard plastic. Well, it's kind of like, yeah, these are like rubbery little thingies. Okay, then. Next, we have... I don't know why everything has to come with sunglasses. That annoys me. Because, like, all the OMG dolls come with sunglasses. These come with sunglasses. Like, it's annoying. I don't understand why. Because I don't really use sunglasses that much. Like, when you buy outfit packs, they come with sunglasses. So, we'll have to see how those look on her. And then we need the doll herself. Now, honestly, guys, my favorite part of this doll is her hair. Whoops. I am obsessed with her hair. That is my favorite part of this doll. Like, I love the style of it. I love the color of it. I just love everything about her hair. Um, I mean, I do kind of like, I hate the... Hmm. Guys, why is there 8,000 rubber bands? And so many damn kajinkers. Okay. So, I, the one thing I love about these is these are on the made to move bodies. Um, now, as far as, like, her body goes and stuff. Whoops. Hold on. Um, okay, guys, hold on. I just I don't know where her shoe just went. Wait a second, guys. Hold on. Uh, uh. Great, guys. I'm losing things already. I literally just opened her. Well, that's great, guys. Whoa. Sorry, guys. Okay. So. So we'll go bit by bit. Okay. So I absolutely love, love, love her hair. Hold on. I didn't realize her hair is could just stuck to her clothes. So I absolutely love, love, love her hair. Her hair is in these two braids. The colors of these are really, really pretty. 
She's got kind of a mean looking face though, honestly. To me, I don't know if she's supposed to be black or not, but to me, she kind of looks like she... is, um, like, I want to say Hispanic. She's got some really pretty makeup. She's got a little mole on. I mean, she's got these earrings. They're cute, but, like, they're not my favorite things in the world. I'm not a huge fan of gold in general. I prefer silver over gold. And then next she's got on all these necklaces. I don't know why she has three necklaces on. But, I mean, I like the look of, like, the layered look with the necklaces. But I don't think she really needs the longer necklace on the bottom. You can't really see her shirt because this is, um, kajinkered. But this is, I believe, a t-shirt. Yeah, this is a t-shirt. I'm not going to take the kajinkers out because I'm not going to change her. This is love. I really like this airbrushed style look. This is like um, something you would get like from a state fair or any kind of fair or something. This jacket. Now this jacket. I absolutely hate these tassels. They remind me of like a rock and roller or something. I mean, the jacket is very cute. I absolutely love, if you can see, like, the bottom of this, the tie-dye design, because tie-dye is actually really big right now. The next feature about her that I love, mm, these jeans are super cute. Um, I wish the pockets were real, though, on these jeans. They could have done a little more work, like, spent a little bit more money on the jeans. They're cute. This doll comes with a watch. I thought she had another bracelet on. She was like a watch thing. I swear to Bob she had another. I swear to Bob she had another bracelet on, guys. She may not have. Yeah. She has like that watch on. Oh yeah, she's having another bracelet on, guys. Okay, so these little pieces are very easy to lose if you have little ones. If you're buying this for a child. Um. Now, I don't understand if you can see why they're both on the same wrist like that and why she needed two bracelets, but I don't like the combination of the two bracelets. They'd be cute individually or maybe even on, I'm going to see if they look like on opposite wrists, but I feel like they don't both need to be on the same wrist. I feel like that's kind of dumb. Next thing I'm. Yeah, it definitely looks better if you put them on opposite wrists. Instead of having them both on the same wrist. Next thing is. She's got green socks with like these little high heel boots. I like. I don't understand the green socks, guys. Why the green socks? They don't match. They literally don't match. Anything else? The boots are cute, though. Um, the one thing, too, that I've noticed so far is that the boots don't stay on very well. They're very loose-fitting, which is kind of annoying. Um, and then the other thing, too, is this has good range of motion. Her head turns all the way around side to side. She's got, she's on the made-to-move Barbie body. She's got the jointed arms. The, the joints are very stiff on the wrists. And then the jointed knees. 
She does not, however, have the jointed feet, which is fine. But I prefer, like, that's the one thing, like, I want to collect some of the Fast, fast Denisha Barbies. But the thing I don't like about the Fast Denisha Barbies is that, like, they don't move. I hate, like, dolls like that. I prefer dolls that are on, that are jointed like this. Ball jointed. Um, I would love to get into BJD dolls, ball, which is ball jointed dolls. Overall, she's really pretty. I mean, aside from the fact that her face looks kind of mean, um, and I don't have any, um, Hispanic dolls. And I have one doll that kind of looks Hispanic, so we say she's Hispanic. But the majority of my dolls, I mean, eighty percent of my dolls. Are Caucasian. Then, mo then most of the ones. So out of the other twenty percent, like fifteen percent are. Well, no, I think like ten percent are black, are African American and um, Asian, and then the other. 10%, like 5% is either Native American or Indian. I mean, yeah, Native American or Indian. And the other 5% is like random. But most of my dolls are primarily Caucasian. I mean, I do have two Asian reborns, I have an African American reborn. I have. I'm trying to think what else. I have an Indian play doll. Two of my bergers are African American. I have the Asian bird, oh, Asian berger. I have. Oh, you don't got. I have a Native American sugar birches doll. I have a Amish doll. I can't remember what brand she is. I've got a Steve Urkel doll. So, you know, got a little bit of everything. So, yeah. So, this is my Barbie Extra doll. Um. Like I said, there won't be a ton of Barbie videos. I'm not a huge Barbie fan. Barbie, I mean, I don't hate Barbie, but Barbie's just not my favorite thing anymore. But I'm starting to get into them a little bit more than I used to. Um, if more videos to come will be more, I definitely will do a lot more Kindy Kid videos. I still have to get all the accessories. I still have to get, well, all except one. I still have to get the pets. I still have to get the last mini Kindy Kid. There's one more doll I have to get eventually. But I can't find it for a reasonable price anywhere. Um, I still have to get. I'm trying to think what else. I'm hoping to do brats videos at some point. I mean, I do want the life size Barbies, the two thirty dollar ones to have the two big um birthday Barbies. I do. Um, at some point, I will get eventually the life size Rapunzel. And the life size Ariel. But I'm definitely shooting for Rapunzel over Ariel. I'm eventually going to get more LOLs again. Hopefully, I'll find the sugar that I've, or sweets, sorry, that I've been looking for. Um, who else? I mean, if you guys want to see more Barbie videos, please let me know. Because there are a couple fast Denisha Barbies that I want that they do have in stores. I want the bald g girl. I want the guy with the long hair. I want the two with prosthetic legs. I'm hoping to have more life, my life as videos. Because eventually I'll find the um, my life as. I want the um, Hello Kitty one, the African American one. 
I'll eventually have more our generation videos. We have lots more coming eventually over time, but for now. This is my new Barbie, and I super love her. She's super cute, and I'm debating if I'm going to get the other one, but I probably won't. The one, uh, number three, I think it is, the one with the pink jacket. I'm not getting all of them. I'm very picky about my Barbies. And I'm hoping to get the BMR doll. She's got, like, the braided hair. So, yeah, anyways, I'm going to go because I have a lot more videos to make. Because I'm very behind on videos because I epically failed this week. Well, week three. So, I got to make up for it on week four. So, I'm going to go and we'll catch you on the flip side. Bye, guys.